The Apple Watch is a great piece of technology, but like so many new gadgets, until it finds its place in the world, it's a solution looking for a problem. But one problem that everyone has from time to time is getting locked out of a building without their keys. What better key to use than the device you always wear on your wrist? In this project by Mark Jensen, James Squires, and Sean Roski, we use an Apple Watch with a specific app to generate a 128-bit RF key and then use an RF-enabled variant of an Arduino to unlock a door at the tap of a wrist. Of course, you'll need an Apple Watch for this project, but any model will do. You'll also need the following electronics components. And you'll need the following tools. Let's get started. We'll begin by building the circuit. Be sure to visit the project page for detailed instructions and schematics. The door strike we're using requires 12 volts to unlock, while the RF Duino can only handle 3.3. As a result, we'll use a voltage regulator to step the voltage down to the appropriate level. Next, download and install the app to your iPhone. While that's going on, grab the RF Duino code from the Git repository and bring it into the Arduino IDE, but don't load it onto your board yet. This project works by using the app to generate a unique 128-bit key that is then broadcast using the RF radio on the Apple Watch. When the RF Duino detects a key that it recognizes, it supplies voltage to the door strike. The door strike we're using is a fail-closed model, so it will remain locked even when the power goes out but when power is supplied to the strike, the latch will be released. Launch the iPhone app and go to the Keys tab. Tap the plus icon to add a new door and enter a name and unique ID. Once generated, copy the door name, key, and handshake and send these to yourself in an email or note. In the Arduino sketch, there are three variables that you need to change. It's the three values you just copied. Once applied, upload the sketch to the Arduino. You're nearly ready to install the door strike, but first, solder the other side of the JST connector to the two terminals on the door strike. Polarity doesn't matter with this connection. With everything set up, it's time to install the door strike. Use a pen to mark out the basic shape of it, and use a chisel to start removing material. Make sure that the strike is centered on the existing door latch, and that the strike latch is facing the direction that the door opens in. Install the door strike using two screws, being mindful as to how the wires are run. Finally, mount the RF Duino to the door frame. You can use a project enclosure if you want to keep things tidy. Your Apple Watch enabled door lock is ready to use. The app geofences the doors that it has stored in it so you only see the ones that are close by. This project doesn't interfere with existing security for the door so if the power goes out you can still use your mechanical keys. How are you using your Apple Watch? Let us know in the comments below. If you liked this video, subscribe to our channel or send us a comment on Facebook or Twitter. Be sure to check out our other project videos or visit us on makezine.com.